are headed to the Harlem Heights neighborhood in Fort Myers today to help families that are still trying to recover after Hurricane Ian. Fox 4's Lauren Petrelli is following the organization Eight Days of Hope as they kick off all of their efforts today. She's in Harlem Heights right now. Lauren. Good morning, ladies. There is no doubt that Hurricane Ian devastated this area. And yes, it has made many steps towards recovery, but there is still a lot to be done. That is why the volunteers with Eight Days of Hope plan on focusing on this area for the next several days. Now, if you were with us earlier, you saw we were at their meeting facility where they were doing a little breakfast fuel up. They were doing their prayer and then everyone was going to be getting their assignments. We left ahead of the crew that we're following for today as they're going to be helping the people who live in this home here in Harlem Heights. There's a lot of debris already out on the curb side. We see pieces of siding of the house. We also see tile from maybe inside of a kitchen is what it looks like. So they've already started working on this area as those crews arrived over the weekend on Saturday and they will continue until this Saturday. I want you to maybe follow me over here on bar. This is our photographer. Take it nice and easy. I don't want you to trip, but you can take a peek inside of this house and see it has been completely gutted by the crews who have come through here and tried to help as this home didn't only see wind damage, but it saw a lot of flooding damage. We actually have video from after Hurricane Ian. This is going to be the Fox 4 drone video that shows not just this specific spot we're in, but all of Harlem Heights and the devastation that they saw after Hurricane Ian. So eight days of hope. It has a very large group of volunteers that are going to be helping so many people here in Southwest Florida, and they are planning on helping about 100 families. They're going to do that through roof work, electrical work, demo work, whatever these families need. That is going to be their plan. And they actually came here several weeks after the hurricane. They came here on Saturday. Once again, they will be here again until this Saturday doing as much work as they possibly can. Some of these crews are international as well. The person I'm following is from Western Kentucky, but I've met people from Wisconsin, Mississippi, and even Canada. So we're gonna follow that crew as soon as they get here and work alongside of them and show you their amazing efforts and the families that they are helping here in our very own backyard. In Harlem Heights, Lauren Petrelli, Fox 4 News.